Arthroscopic closure of the hip capsule using the loop lock knotless suture. Unwind the FiberLink passing suture by pulling the suture from the suture management card labeled number one until the suture tail is exposed. After passing the FiberLink suture tail through both limbs of capsule, pull the suture tail until the striped loop lock suture is outside of the cannula. Cut the loop side of the FiberLink passing suture with fiber wire scissors. Unwind the suture labeled number two on the suture management card until the tail is exposed. Feed the suture tail labeled number two through the loop of the loop lock suture and then through the suture threader. Fold approximately five centimeters of suture over the suture threader and pull the suture threader tab labeled number three in an upward motion until the suture splice is complete. Once the splice has been completed, remove the short suture tail labeled number four and remove the remaining suture from the tabs and dispose of the packaging card. Even out the two strands of suture. Put one finger behind the suture splice and pull slack out of the loop lock suture until the interlocking loops are positioned under the capsule. Pull on each of the tensioning strands, alternating approximately two centimeters on each side, until the suture splice seats on the two limbs of capsular tissue. To improve suture management, fiber wire suture scissors may be used to cut and shorten the length of the suture strands prior to the final tensioning. Feed both limbs of the suture into the jaws of the closed suture cutter and advance it until it is fully seated against the loop lock suture. Pull each strand of suture for final tensioning and squeeze the handle to cut the suture. Place additional loop lock sutures as needed to complete closure of the hip capsule.